Welcome back to Not Just Photography. I hope you're healthy, safe, and doing well. Please show your appreciation, like and subscribe to my channel. Now back to the channel. Today I'm gonna do a review on hard cases. Today's review is gonna be the Nanook 935 versus the Seahorse 920. Now enough talk, let's go on with the review. Now let's first start about the build quality. The Nanook 935 and the Seahorse 920, the build quality is almost identical. I can't tell the difference. Now let's go on to the handles. The Nanook 935 has a rubber handle which has grooves in there so you can hold it in your hand and grips your hand nicely. On the other hand, the Seahorse 920 just has a plastic hard handle which is hard on your hand. So the winner for the handle is the Nanook 935. Now let's go on to the lock. Okay, the lock. The Nanook 935 has some type of claw type lock which latches down which seems pretty good. And then the Seahorse 920 just has one of those twist locks, just locks. So, in my opinion, the Nanook 935, the um, claw type lock is much better. So the winner for the lock is the Nanook 935. And now let's go on to the wheels, okay? The Nanook 935 has roll, roller blade type wheels which are round, which guide through easily through snow, dirt, mud, and so forth. But the Seahorse 920 has big black hard plastic wheels, which looks like wheels that you will find on a toy car. So the winner for the wheels is the Nanook 935. And finally, let's talk about ergonomics. Okay, the Nanook 935 has, has a, the handle has two levels, which will be shown. The handle can adjust by two levels and at the end the handle has a soft rubber groove handle for gripping. On the other hand, the Seahorse 920 only has one level the handle can pull up to, which is stuck on that level. And the handle does not have a rubber grip. So the winner for ergonomics is the Nanook 935. Now let's look at the inside, the outside, the sides of all the cases. Let me show you. Okay, this is a close-up of both of the front of the cases. This is a close-up of uh, the sides of the cases. And let's show you the back of the cases. And then there's one more thing I'd like to talk about is the padlock. On the Nanook 935, the padlock holds as a reinforced metal type alloy in the hole. On the other hand, the Seahorse 920 just has a hole inside the padlock hole. So we will demonstrate this and we will show you. So the overall winner is the Nook 935. For the value and the price and the ergonomics, the Nook 935 is the overall winner. 
once again, thank you for watching Not Just Photography. Please show your appreciation by liking and subscribing. Thank you.